In this video, we're going to go over my secret email template. Now, this is a email template here that is very, very powerful. Okay, I'm going to share with you the metrics here that I've been able to achieve with uh, this email uh, particular template. And you'll notice here that it has 72 percent open rate huge right this is massive as far as being able to get people interested in wanting to open the email most emails don't even get opened because they are spam uh, people are just saying the same thing over and over again they're just trying to sell a product or pitch a service right they're talking about themselves you'll find my email copy strategy and the framework and the process that I work with is all centered around having a conversation with the individual, right? Because um, that's going to be the best way that you can really get people to open your emails, respond back to you and have a conversation because uh, you're not trying to pitch them. It's like a normal conversation where if you're going out on a date with somebody, you're typically not going to want to get married on the first date, right? Uh, you're going to get to know each other, see if there's a fit, see if there's an opportunity uh, for you guys to get to know each other even more, right? And so uh, the first thing is really getting the emails to be opened and obviously uh, get the responses, right? So 72% uh, actual open rate here, 19% uh, response rate. So let me show you the emails. And what you'll notice here is that the emails are very uh, much so vague, but they're artfully vague, okay? And what I'm leveraging here is I'm leveraging uh, their business, whatever security company that I'm targeting here, uh, the uh, email software is going to automatically post that in here, okay? So I have the first name here, um, their business name right here, and I'm mentioning to them that I love what they're doing in the security space, okay? You always want to have something where you're mentioning to them uh, hey, I found you doing X, Y, and Z, or I um, came across your business and love what you're doing. And we're going to go over this framework here uh, in another video uh, for the email templates. Uh, but I just want to show you uh, the metrics here and this particular template uh, and all the other templates that I have here as far as the follow-ups, okay? And then the second line here is um, we've helped some of the top security and risk management companies, right? And here's a uh, name drop in. Now, this is where I've been able to leverage case studies from other businesses where I haven't directly worked with these companies. However, I'm leveraging other people's work, right? That's the key thing here is being able to leverage other people's case studies and be able to uh, utilize that in your marketing efforts. And then um, grow their customer base with our ACD process. Now, this is not anything crazy or spectacular. This ACD process is on our website and it stands for awareness, consideration, and decision. Nothing revolutionary, extraordinary. However, it gives the impression that we have a very unique formula, a very unique process uh, for getting customers, getting clients. And so that really gives us our unique selling proposition, right? Our unique selling mechanism there. And then uh, this one here is probably one of the most important here. I'd like to run it by you to see what you think and if it might be of interest to you. And if not for you, maybe someone else you may know that would qualify. And this is Artfully Vague 101. This is extremely powerful here because I didn't tell them anything about how the ACD process works, but I did tell them that we've used this process to get customers for these types of businesses up here, right? And so it has that curiosity factor there where um, we're letting them know that we would like to run it by them to see if it may be of interest to them. And if it's not for them, if it may not be for you know their business, then maybe somebody else that they could potentially recommend, right? So it's kind of the curiosity factor and then the takeaway because uh, we're letting them know that if it's not for them, than somebody else that they may feel or think, right, that would qualify. So very powerful. And then I have here the call to action. When would be a good time for us to connect? Remember, with the call to actions, you don't want to be uh, maybe, probably, can you, do you, right? It's all about, um, hey, when is a good time, 
right, for us to connect. Second email here, okay? Uh, we have nice and simple. Hi, first name. I'm sure you're busy and wanted to make sure this didn't get buried, right? This is, uh, I believe it's two days after. And then this one here, I think this is three days after. And then it's pretty much the same. Hey, I sent you an email a while back and wanted to circle back and make sure you were able to receive it, right? And so pretty much the same thing. And then the final one here is the uh, hi, first name. At this point, I'll assume this isn't a priority at this time. Please feel free to reach out if anything changes. Uh, we'd love to work together. So this is my secret email template here. This is extremely powerful. This line right here is really what sells it and what really gets people interested because we're not only telling them that we are an authority, that we have you know previous clients that we've been able to work with and get results for, right? And using our unique methodology, our unique process, and then we're looking to find out if they would be interested in learning more about it and if it's not for them, right, then somebody else that they think or feel would qualify. So this is extremely, extremely powerful here. So use this template here. I wouldn't recommend you use this word for word. Take this template and um, kind of customize it and make it your own. And that's going to be it here for this one. 